much longer until we find Esha. All this walking is getting tiring. I think I'm getting thirsty too. I concur. If I knew we were to walk this much, I would have bought a drink. Here, take this then. Oh, how very kind. Thank you. Huh? <sighs> it's chill, refreshing, and so easy to drink. How delightful. I'm glad you liked it. What? what? What's wrong, Nepgear? Why are you opening and closing your mouth like a fish? N Neptune, why are you here? It's been a while, huh? Haven't seen you since Zero Dimension, and I haven't seen Miss Busty over here since that hotel bath. Huh? You? Do you know her too, Vert? Yes, we've met at the hotel's public bath, but I didn't realize she was the other Neptune that you had met. Surprised, aren't ya? Well, yes. I can hardly believe it. I couldn't see your face well with all that steam. But you look just like Neptune. But why are you here? Simple. It's because I'm a member of Affimax, and I'm on a mission to intercept the two of you. Uh... What? <laughs> why are you part of Affimax? Hmm... Well, it's complicated. But since that's what's happening, let's just battle it out already. I can't fight with Neptune! If I could help it, I wouldn't fight you either, Nepgear. Even though it's a sad thing, that's just how this plot unfolds. It is my turn! I'll use an item. Leave this to me! Neptunem! Go! What is this, robot? Yeah! Hey! All right! The final strike! Ouch! Hey! All right! Into the oh. specimen book. Now, who to choose? Do ours effect. I no. shall go. No. <laughs> Just kidding. Good timing. What shall I do? I will skewer you all at once! Stop! Alright, get to the specimen Ouch. book. I'll be serious! It is my turn. Please use this. Nice timing! Finally! <gasps> no! no! I'll be serious! This is all I have! Limiter release! Max beam output! Stop! Ah! Ouch! Stop! Thank ya! We will carve our way into the future! Hey! Stop! As expected of you, Nepgear, I think you've gotten a little stronger since we last met. And you are much better than I expected, Miss Busty. I welcome the compliment, but could you refrain from calling me that absurd name? Well, sure. Then what should I call you? Well, how about a more sweet and adorable name? Perhaps you can call me... Bert. All right, break time over. Let's resume the battle. Hey, why are you ignoring me? 
It is my turn. I shall go for <laughs> Just here you go. I'll just keep shooting. No! Ouch! Ouch! Prepare final slash! No! It's kind of painful. Please use this! Good timing. It is my turn. I've got you! Hey! Prepare yourself! Ah! Sit! Ouch! Hey! Sit! So very weak. Ouch! No! Ouch! Ouch! Stop you! It's my turn! It is my turn. Bird, we can handle high speed battle. I've been under a... How strange. This didn't go as planned. Oh, how I love that level up sound. Level up. She really is strong. Even if she's a different person, she still fights as a Neptune should. You guys are plenty strong as well. Seriously, I said it already, but you're much stronger than last time, Nepgear. That makes sense, though. You've probably been grinding a lot down here, huh? No Speaking with such meta-mannerisms is just like our Neptune as well. Neptune, please, stand aside! We don't have any time to be wasting in fighting you right now. Besides... I don't even want to fight with you. Yeah, sure thing. Uh, huh? My job was just to stall you guys. I'm not really trying to defeat you. Besides, she never told me how long I had to stall you for anyway. I probably accomplished my mission by now, I think. Neptune, what's going on in that brain of yours? Well, see you again soon, Nepgear, Miss Busty. Neptune, wait! She left. Why is she? I understand that it concerns you, but we must stop Esha before doing anything else. Yeah, I know, I know. Since you had more of a relationship with her, it's difficult for me to empathize in the same way. In any case, you will have to hold that thought until we locate Esha. I have a feeling the reason Neptune stood in our way is related to her somehow. So you think Esha is connected to Affimax? Possibly. If my reasoning is correct, anyway. But to confirm this, we must move on ahead. Esha! You two. I'm surprised you found this place. What are you planning on doing by gathering all the ran pigs? It does not concern you. It does concern us! We've come here because Isha urged us to find you. I see. That's why there were messages on my cell phone I couldn't recall. I'll ask you again. What are you planning to accomplish by sacrificing a million Rand pigs? I guess it's no use. I'll tell you. Now that we know the Demon King was just an illusion, I have run out of options. Before her soul disappears, I must create a vessel for my soul. What are you getting at? Then, listen well to the tale of a pitiful girl. Very well. The truth of our current strife will finally be explained. I will listen to the reason you've persisted for so long. A long time ago, I was creating a film. I made a mistake that almost took my life. Mm? <laughs> huh? I'm sorry. For a moment, I thought you said film. Did you say kiln? As in those industrial ovens? No, you heard correctly. A film. When you say film, you're referring to the moving pictures, yes? Not some kind of coding? Correct. <laughs> what do you mean you are making a film? I thought I'd finally hear the truth of our situation, and you begin by telling jokes? Return my excitement this instant. Please calm down, Vert. It may get more exciting from here on out, so let's listen until the end of the story. After my failure and I began to die, Isha reached out a helping hand. We weren't particularly close, 
In fact, it could be said that we were rivals. But even still, she tried to save me. Unfortunately, my body was far too gone for her spells to have effect. Using a forbidden spell, she took my soul from my dying body and transferred it into hers. Ever since then, this body has held the souls of both Isha and me. But human bodies aren't designed to house two souls at once. Naturally, her body couldn't withstand the burden, and although it's been gradual, it's beginning to break. That's why you wish to obtain a body of your own. Exactly. I can't let Isha die. Oh! You're not thinking of creating a new body with those ran pigs, are you? That's exactly what I'm thinking. I thought the Demon King's body would satisfy the law of equivalent exchange, but that's not possible now. The ran pigs will have to do. I finally understand the reason you were so persistent about the Demon King. And, as I suspected, the soldiers weren't recruited for fighting outside invaders. You just needed them to capture him. Correct. And the invaders were created yourself in order to train the soldiers, yes? You caught on to that plan too, did you? Of course. Even though the parts were from other nations, they all had a stamp that clearly showed they were from Leanbox. As expected of a CPU, I suppose. But that doesn't matter now. Gooman! Lady! Ha 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 ha! You called, Esha? What's our job this time? Are the preparations complete? If you're talking about the Ran Pigs, yes. All one million are in their cages. All right. I'll head to the ritual area immediately. Please, deal with these two. So, they figured us out. Okay. We'll do our best for Isha. It's in your hands now. Where are you going? Whoa there. Step back. You two won't be getting any farther than this. Then we'll simply pass through by force. Let's go, Nepgear. Okay. Even if my opponents are CPUs, my pectorals can handle this. I'm not very fond of these hot-blooded types. What shall I do? Terai Division! It's my turn! Defensive cheer! Here I go! Be entranced by my muscles. Do ours effect. Thank you. What should I do? I do. I will skewer you all. Here I go. Can you do something? Be entranced by my oh, muscles. Leave this to me. Heal. Good timing. What shall I do? Oh. 
I'll use an item. Okay. <laughs> Ouch! I've got you! Ouch! Yes. What? Prepare yourself! Ouch! You're wide Ouch. open! Ouch. I'll be serious! Here I go! <laughs> I will attack! Are you ready? Do you mean to tell me even my highly trained pectorals can't take these attacks? I'll be serious! Bird, we can handle high-speed battle! I never thought I'd be cornered like this. I'll use my trump card. Sexy pose! Um... Oh, oh no! This tried and true pose of sexiness won't work against girls! Damn it! Okay. Be, oh! Be entranced by my Here I muscles. Go. Oh, what should I do? My muscles. Oh, there's okay. Still... I'll be serious. Here you go. <sighs> I'm Muscles saved. that exceed my no, muscles. I will attack. Are you ready? Here I go! Out! Not geared him! What shall I do? I've got you! No! You're wide open! Prepare your... Oh dear. Leave this to me! This is all I have! Next? I'm a mess. My beauty has been further polished. Damn! You've got a great punch. My pectorals are still jiggling. <sighs> I'm done as well. You're really strong, Vert. You two are surely aware of what Esha is attempting to do, yes? Of course. Then why do you help her? That's because Isha... I've even heard of someone using a forbidden spell to displace a soul. But it's what Isha truly wanted. So we decided that we'd all live together along with Esha. However, after some time had passed, Esha revealed that a time was coming when her body could no longer hold both of their souls. Since then... We've searched so desperately for a way to save Isha. And so you've arrived at this method. That's right. We may not have known her long, but Esha is a part of our family. She was saved purely by the kindness of Isha's heart. That's enough of a reason for us to help, even if we have to do something inhumane. Well, I don't think you two were very human to begin with. D don't be so insensitive, Vert. They have such a good moving story to tell. I understand why you would support her, but there's something that simply doesn't make sense. What is it? How did Esha come to discover that their body would not last? It is her body, after all. Isn't it natural she would know about her own body the best? What did Isha have to say about it? It was originally her body, was it not? Isha said it wasn't true, but Esha insisted that she was just trying to endure the pain. I see. I have one last question. Who proposed this method of transferring Esha's soul into another vessel, and- The way to create a new body, using the Demon King, or now using the Ram Pigs as substitutes, were all Esha's ideas. But, now that I think of it, it's kind of odd how these ideas seem to have come to her. Odd? How so? 
she often falls asleep while sitting in a chair. Whenever she came up with those ideas Goo Man mentioned, it was always right after she woke. As Shaw's a clever kid, she's probably always thinking of crazy ideas even in her dreams. Well, it was different with the Ren Pigs, though. Someone named R4 suggested that idea. R4? That name. It's the same name as the deity of Sin who once terrorized game industry. It's also the same name as the opponent Nepgear battled in Zero Dimension. That's right. So naturally, we were shocked at the coincidence. But don't worry. She may have bad taste in makeup, but she's definitely a human. Oh, but that girl Neptune who came along with R4 was very sweet inside and out. I didn't expect to hear her name in a place like this. Her characteristics match up with the R4 I fought in Zero Dimension too, but... I thought we had defeated her. I see now. I'm starting to see some connections here. This is merely speculation, but it might be possible that R4 has deceived Esha. Could that really be true? My instincts tell me it's highly probable. Then would that mean this whole issue about her body falling apart isn't true? If Esha didn't agree with Esha's story about the failing body, then it's likely. Deception is a game R4 is all too familiar with. No way! So we've been tricked! Where is R4 currently? She was with us moments ago, but she suddenly disappeared. Then, in order to find out what is actually going on here, we'll need to speak with both Esha and Isha one more time. Could you two guide us to where they are? Yes, we'll lead the way. Let's go and find the truth together. This is where you're going. Let's aim for a no damage clear. So this is where you're going. Now, let us go together. Phew, I win. This isn't an arcade, is it? Let's go. Leap. Jump. 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 Leap. Jump. Leap. Jump. Leap. Jump. attack. Are you ready? I've got you! I've been underestimated, turn. it seems. There! What should I do? Now, who to choose? Who's next? Enemy yes. sighted. Leave this to me! Next? Yay! We've won! Level up! Jump! 
Huh? A sleep. Jump. Leap. I'm still fine. Thank you for worrying about me. Jump. Leap. Jump. Leap. Jump. What a wonderful item! I wonder what's inside. Huh? A scratch? Oh, you're right! When did I get this? The time has come. Let us begin. Esha, please stop this. Don't get in the way. This is for your sake, too. No, I never wanted it to be like this. This is our only option, Isha. This is all we can do to help ourselves. Can't you see you've been deceived? Won't you please come to your senses? That kind of talk is not necessary now. I'm returning your body to you and that's that. Esha, why? Why has it come to this? Esha, wait! Please, Esha, think this through one more time! Esha, dearest, please! Stop 